Pig the cow and the chicken. I'm checking in with the chef back and behind the scenes. So what's the key to having a good smoked wing? Pass, patience. Mm. Take patience. You can't brush it. Mm. You gotta have the right seasoning. You gotta have the right amount of smoke on it. Passion is the number one thing though. We do everything with passion here at the pig though. Yo, what's the vibes, man? Here we are at the pig, the cow, and the chicken here on Payton Road in the ATL. We're gonna go ahead and check these smoked wings out. Let y'all know what they're hitting on. Y'all come check them out with us. Yo, what's the vibes, man? Here we are at the pig, the cow, and the chicken. Payton Road here in ATL. Yo, man, I ain't gonna hold you, man. When I'm looking at these wings right now, I got a nice smoked wings. I got three sauces with me. I got the tangy, I got the sweet and spicy, and I got the Carolina. So we're gonna make sure we dip them in all sauces and give you all the real flavor. But man, these wings look amazing. They look big. It's probably the biggest wings we've seen so far. Got the whole wing. I'm sure y'all what the whole wing look like. This is what a whole wing looks like, right? Make sure when you're going to go buy your raw meat, if, it's, if the size not hitting like this, you might want to just go ahead and put them down. You know what I mean? We're going to check them out, give you all the flavor rating. I mean, y'all make sure y'all come check out the pig, the cow, and the chicken. Oh, man. Damn. Coming right off the bone, as soon as I open it up, barely had to put any effort on it. I ain't gonna lie, that texture rating I gave at first was a nine, man. I may have to really give him a 10 all the way across the board. The way that just fell off, that wing like that, all right, man, I'm just being honest. You do everything with passion as you pee, though. Mm-hmm, oh yeah. Oh yeah, that Carolina hitting. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yeah, that's hitting right there. Swing tangy to Carolina. I'm about, to try, I'm about to try the spicy right now. Yeah. So we got the Carolina, we got the tangy. Everybody hit that sweet and spicy. Mm-hmm. Mm. Okay. Hey man, the wheat. Hey, the meat falling right up. Hey mommy. When you in town, we coming here, no cap. Wow. That Carolina. Let me tell you something about this Carolina right now. Carolina food, lady, man. That's right, hitting. <laughs> no lie. Wow. Glad we chose this spot today. I ain't gonna hold you. Yo, yo, what's the vibes, man? Here we are checking here at the pig, the cow, and the chicken here on Peyton Road in the ATL. So look. We gave the wings size 10, right? Whole wings, biggest wings we've had so far. The texture, right? Initially, I was thinking about giving the texture a nine, right? Had to put a little effort into, into pulling off the first one I had. When I went into the second one, I really didn't have to do nothing at all. I really fell off. Even when I was eating it, almost like the, the meat was just coming right off the bone before I even, you know, really bit down on it for real. So texture-wise, got it up to a 10, right? And the flavor. Right, three sauces, got the Carolina, sweet and tangy, sweet and spicy. Now there's a difference between that tangy and that spicy, but I'm gonna have to get a tangy, the upper hand on that one. But the best sauce of them all, that Carolina. Show you what that look like. Real Carolina barbecue sauce right there, you know what I mean? That ain't nothing to play with. Nice little spice to it, combination with the wings, impeccable, you know what I mean? But listen, overall, have to give it a 10. Yes, sir. These are, right now, the number one spot we've been to so far. You know, I make sure y'all come check them out. Pig, the cow, and the chicken. Here on Peyton Road in the ATL. You know what time it is.